Hi, Cancer. This is Nayla Latrice. I am here to do a quick read for you guys for the next 48. So let's jump right on in. All right. Spirit, what messages do you have for Cancer for the next 48? All right. So Cancer, we have the Hierophant. We have the Six of Pentacles. And we have the star card. What I am picking up, um, there's a lot of good positive energy. There's committal energy here. There's energy here over the next 48 where somebody is going to want to give you something or bless you with some type of gift. I also see you being in the spotlight or you making some type of moves to where um, people are going to be vying for your attention. I also feel like if you have a business cancer, it is going to be taking off. All of a sudden, you're going to see... Um, the numbers sprout up or the numbers shoot up uh, if you have some type of online business or you're going to see um, a lot of more uh, inquiries as well. I do feel that there is a, a committal energy here that wants to um, connect with you, that wants to be in an equal give and take relationship. I do feel like there is somebody that is wanting to be in your energy that is ready to um, take the next step or take it further with you, Cancer, at this time. Could be dealing with an air sign or a Taurus. But yeah, somebody's ready to give to you. Somebody's ready to make this commitment to you. Could also be dealing with a Virgo here. This is going to be super quick because, y'all, I am, like, in super chill mode. This could be confusing for you, but I feel like um, this is kind of something that you don't see coming or there's just a lot going on. And so it's kind of like you wrap yourself up um, to not be able to see everything that is happening because it's just so much. But I do feel like you're, it's almost like you, you're avoiding making a decision here. Um, but whatever this is, it is going to make you happy here with the Nine of Cups energy. Spirit, why is the Hierophant here? Why is the Hierophant here for Cancer? Yeah, this Four of Cups wanted to pop out. Yep, I'm going to put it right there. Somebody wants to offer you something. This could be somebody that feel like they've had a missed opportunity with you in the past. So this could be somebody that's coming back around. They've learned their lesson and now they want to actually be committal to you and they actually want to commit to you. This also could be somebody new that's paying attention to you and they want to offer um, their cup of uh, emotions to you. Your energy kind of seems like, eh, you're not sure about this connection is what I'm picking up on. I don't know if this is somebody that you're actually interested in, Cancer. I don't, it doesn't seem like this is somebody you're interested in. It seems like you're more interested in yourself um, or just not this person. It seems like you're focused more on your stardom or more on your healing, more on your um, on your career is what I feel like. Yeah, with this five of swords here, this could be somebody that you've cut off, but they want to come back around and give you something. It's like you cut this person off. You did what was best for you and started focusing on you. And this person is feeling your loss. And now they want to come back around. And it doesn't matter how old or new um uh, this is of how recent you've cut them off. You could have cut them off last night. You could have cut them off a year ago. For whatever reason, this person, um, if you're thinking about this person or if this person comes to your mind like, uh, it's probably this person and that's probably who it is. I'm hearing baby daddy or baby's father. I hate saying baby daddy, um, but that's what came through. Um, but I believe this could also be like a baby's father or some somebody that just wasn't doing what they were supposed to be doing. And now that you've cut them off and you've let them go, they want to come back around and be committed to you. But again, I see this person wants to give you something and I see you taking it. I do believe you're going to take it. It's almost like you're saying thanks, but no thanks. So you're going to take whatever it is they give you, but you're saying no thanks to their offer. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Yeah, look at this. This is too much. I'm not going to take all of this, but there's communication coming in. Um, they want to be able to change your life. They see you doing good. They see you turning this wheel by yourself and they want to come in and communicate with you. Spirit, why is this six, okay? Too many, Spirit. Why is this six of pentacles here? Six of pentacles for cancer. 
Look, this person wants to come in and build with you. This person wants to work with you. And again, I see that you want to focus on your work. This could also be a work partnership that's coming in that wants to give you something as well. Uh, uh, something in regards to your career or your passion, your, your, your creative side, your creativity. Again, something that could be putting you in the spotlight. There could be this partnership coming in here if it has nothing to do with love. But whoever this is, there's a partnership here, whether a relationship, work, whatever the case may be. Um, for many, it's emotional. It's an emotional partnership, an emotional connection. But this person, they want to actually build with you. They want to actually um, build a relationship with you far as romance, but they also want to build and work with you far as um, your creative endeavors as well. So you may actually say yes to them on the creative endeavors and say no to them on the relationship front. Look at you. You're the empress. You're sitting pretty. They see you as the empress as well. This is for the star card. Yes, we have judgment here. This definitely could could be somebody from your past coming back um this is you making this decision on what it is you want and again cancer i feel like you're more focused on you're more focused on your um career at this time and what it is you want to do moving forward you're focused on being single and building your own household up at this time okay spirit why is this eight of swords here yeah this three of uh um this three of wands wanted to come out. So it lets me know you're focused on moving forward during this next 48. So what messages do you have for cancer for the next 48 for this eight of swords? Look at this. It doesn't matter if we use three of wands or the chariot. Um, but chariot is big energy, major arcana. This lets me know that you are truly moving forward. Um, there's a lot of business energy here for you, cancer. I feel like that's what your focus is. And this is your energy. Some of you guys could be focused on getting a car or buying a car at this time. Um, but you guys are moving forward successfully. I do see you guys getting a car or finding a solution to um to having a car or an, an alternative for not having a car um but whatever you work out your car situation pretty much some of you guys are actually moving as well some of you guys are graduating doctors as well congratulations on that accomplishment But yeah, I see you pretty much just moving forward. And look at what we still have here. We still have you moving forward um, from all of this, this, from this entire situation. So this could just be something quick that happens uh, for you. And it's kind of like, uh, you, you're focused more on your business or something happens over this weekend that lets you know that you should be more focused on your business um, rather than this person or other people. You're going through a major transformation at this time. You're letting a lot of different relationships go, uh, cancer you could be dealing with a uh, scorpio which is another water sign okay let's go ahead and pull some romance angels whoa and let's see what they say spirit what messages do you have what messages do you have for the next 48 for cancer next 48 for cancer new love you don't want this love right here because you have a new love that is coming towards you okay playfulness spirit is advising you to be playful with this person coming in spirit with messages this person is worth waiting for again you're you're focused on your career and everything else um you may need some advice for your from your friends or may just need to spend some time hanging out with your friends spirit one more for cancer romantic feelings you're going to have romantic feelings for someone coming up and then we have religious factors so this could be um you guys believe different things uh one person is more spiritual than the other something along those lines cancer i am going to leave your read here this is just a quick read for the next 48 for you comment below how it resonates and also thumbs up this video if you guys are interested in a personal read reiki services or a clarity and a advice call on relationships your work purpose any of that then you can book me at the link below um until next time i will see you guys later bye